What is up, guys? It is Bobby Gazoo here, and just you know, this is just random gameplay that I, gameplay that I found. Um, anyways, I'm not here to commentate on this gameplay. I'm here to talk about Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Yes, they added another line to that to make it a two, and well, it's official. It is true. <laughs> that sentence rhymed. Um, Call of Duty Black Ops 2. You remember? I was talking about how there's rumors going on in a previous video. I was very unsure about this. I thought Black Ops 2 would bring nothing to the table. I thought it'd be the same old Black Ops, maybe just a new campaign, <coughs> maybe a better combat training, and new maps. That's all I really thought. You know, a couple new guns too. I definitely did not expect what we got, you know? I mean, come on. No one expected Black Ops 2 to take place in the future. I mean, come on. 2025, Woods is miraculously still alive, and... I don't know, it's just insane. I mean, I, I honestly, that honestly, uh, that did blow my mind. I, I, um, you know, was very surprised. Now, in this game, I am going against combat training. <coughs> Just because I don't actually have real gameplay of online, except for me trying to get my um, sniper montage. <laughs> so, um, <coughs> I just have... I was going to do a series for combat training, but I decided not to. Um, anyways, so... Um, I do not want to get sidetracked on this. I... <laughs> So anyways, Black Ops 2. Here's a couple things that I've noticed, and I'm not positive if anyone else has noticed this. But when you have, um, you know, ugly, McUgly face there, uh, Woods, when you hear him say, you know, the thing about, um, whatchamacallit, like, they need men like us, when you see the guy crouching with the M16, pause the screen there, and look at that screen. You know, just look at it. And on the right side, you'll notice a beam flying up into the sky. What's that? Oh, that's a purplish colored blue beam. That is the mystery box, my friends. Yeah, it's true. Uh, zombies is back also. Um, it doesn't surprise me, to be honest, because Treyarch is going to have zombies for every game that they come out with now. Because it is a main income source of why people are buying this game. I, I know a bunch of people that never even played online, but played hours and hours of zombies. It just comes to show how much zombies has changed Call of Duty over the years with a shooter. Well, actually, <laughs> a story mode, an online shooter, to zombies. I mean, come on. I mean, I think it's great, though. Um... So, I don't know, I'm very excited right now. Um, and I'll play the clip, uh, not the uh, actual like video, but I'll play the audio. Um, I have my other computer right here, one second. But, I, here's what I've heard about the perks. Um, the perks are supposedly, um... One second. Anyways, the perks are supposedly supposed to be set up in strings. Um, so there's gonna be one strand, and there's gonna be another strand of perks. Um, you know, there's supposed to be the elite strand and the prestige strand, or uh, it's elite strand and I don't know if it's prestige strand. It's a, it's a different word, or I think, or something like that. But anyways, so there's no pro perks anymore. They completely screwed the idea of pro perks. Instead, I think this, I don't know, it could be good, it could be not, but, um, supposedly, there's two strands, like I said, you choose one at the beginning of a prestige, and you're stuck with that one for the rest of the prestige until you prestige again to reset it. Now, a strand would be like scavenger version 1, scavenger version 2. So, strand elite would be like all the version 1s. And then Prestige would be all version 2s. So for Elite, you know, you'd be like, Oh, I got Scavenger version 1, 
Sun of Hand version 1, whatever other primary perks there are, too. And then for um, Prestige, you get, you know, Scavenger version 2 and Sun of Hand version 2. Um, that is official. That's up on the website. You could read on it. I mean, you could read it uh, and stuff. That's just from memory. I'm not actually reading it right now on this. Uh, but... I am going to get to the part where Woods is talking about, you know, when they need soldiers like us. Um, but I'm telling you, it's insane. Now, I, I do think that the campaign, I'm telling you, this is going to be one of the best Call of Duty campaigns in Call of Duty history. I, that's just my honest opinion. I think that this will be great. <laughs> I'm telling you, great. Oh my god. It's a, such a new perspective to the whole Call of Duty, you know, gaming. And I don't know, it's insane, I think, um, to take on the future. You know, I mean, they've gone from the Cold War and Vietnam War, you know, 1960s. <laughs> to 2025, you know, Black Ops, um, the original, and Black Ops 2. Now, there is one thing that, that could be and should be different. Black Ops 2 should not be called Black Ops 2. It should be called Call of Duty Black Ops something, an alternative um, title. It's just so it's not Black Ops 2. You know, I mean, it's a little bland on their part. You know, they could have come up with something, you know, like... Uh, I don't know, it's it's America versus machine, or it's man versus machine, or man versus China, which, that is, I think that's accurate, I think China will go to war, um, and try to conquer, but anyways, besides that, it should be like, I don't know, Black Ops 2, China Revelation, or, I have no idea, like, Machine Revelation, uh, Machine Evolution, or something like that, I have no idea what the name should be. Because I'm not the one that made it, and it's not out yet. But, I, all I know is that it should be named more than just Black Ops 2. A little bland on that part, but, come on, it's just the title. Who gives a crap? Um, now, I think it's a mix of Call of Duty, Battlefield, and, not Halo. People get, yeah, that's another thing. People keep on saying it's a, like it has too much Halo, quote unquote, in it. <laughs> Come on, Halo takes place in two, I mean, in like two thousand nine hundred or three thousand or whatever it is. I'm not, I, I forgot the date because I've played Halo for such a long time. But I mean, come on, how can you refer to two thousand twenty-five to two thousand nine hundred? Yeah, <laughs> I mean, in Halo they have aliens invading with laser guns. In the in this, it's still machine guns. It's not like the shooting. Little laser blasters and ray guns everywhere. No, it's it's actual guns, which is nice. Now, the gun thing, I, I do not know. I'm I'm not completely sure about this, but um, I think that we will recognize none of the guns. I honestly think uh, they're all going to be either made up guns or like quote unquote future versions of a gun. You know, it's not official version, it's just their way of showing, this is in the future. Um, so, you know, the gun that's in the trailer that the commander, uh, Harper, that's the guy's name, like, I think it is, Harper, um, the gun that he's holding is, um, an assault rifle. It looks like an either A, a generic assault rifle, or B, a highly, you know, high-tech new version of the G36C from Modern Warfare 3. Now, I'm not positive, obviously. <laughs> it is all, most of my talk is about assumptions. Um, and another thing is that every online Call of Duty map is supposed to be turned into a zombie map. That's another thing that I've heard. Now, a lot of these are rumors, but the perk thing is true. It's announced on the website. Um trying to think what else um there's a lot of stuff happening now i will have more videos than just this one on black ops i mean come on there's endless information coming out every day i mean i was shocked to just have a trailer let alone discussion about zombies 
discussion about maps, discussion about gameplay, discussion about, about campaign, <coughs> discussion about perks, weapons, vehicles, kill streaks. Everything was just mind blowing, I think. Um, to have all this stuff be announced on the day that, you know, May 1st, you know, the day that they're showing it. But, anyways, time is running out here, guys. This is Bob Kikazoo signing out. I'll talk to you guys later.